The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Miami, Florida, weighing 260 pounds, the WWE Champion, The Rock. Oh, this match is gonna be exciting. I can almost guarantee it. Big match for him here tonight. And approaching the ring from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, the million dollar champion, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Man, listening to the reaction this guy gets from a crowd never gets old. You made a smart choice tuning in for this one, folks. This match promises to be absolutely amazing. This will surely be a true mano a mano test. It's amazing. For more than 50 years, men and women have entered this ring all in the name of greatness to see who is truly the best. I think when it's all said and done, we'll be talking about this match for a long time. A series of unanswered shots from The Rock. Nobody electrifies the WWE Universe like The Rock. When you're in the ring with The Rock, you have to do everything in your power to avoid that spine buster. Because you know what comes right after that. A good opportunity for the champ to try out some new things here. What's the worst that can happen? A loss? Who cares? It's not like the title's on the line. Whoa. Boy, he just got laid out. Whoa. This could be huge. A thunderous spine buster. I'm not sure I can watch this. Four. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit in them tonight. To King's earlier point, once The Rock hits that spine buster, Six. you can almost guarantee the people's elbow is next, which has resulted in arenas coming virtually unglued. Seven. And equally as dangerous, though, would have to be The Rock's sharpshooter. Of course, it was that move that controversially awarded The Rock his first ever WWE Championship at the 1998 Survivor Series. Uh-oh. Steve Austin showing some expert prowess here. What a beast Steve Austin has been so far in this match. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. It goes without saying that The Rock is among the most charismatic superstars the sports entertainment industry has ever seen. Oh, that's true, Michael. But The Rock's not just all glitz and catchphrases. He also knows what he's doing inside that ring. Hence, all the championships. Quick thinking to avoid that. Dangerous submission hold here. How much punishment can he absorb? No. I don't believe the destruction we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another.
Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. A nice inverted suplex there. I do not doubt The Rock's ability inside that ring for one second, King. All I'm saying is that there's a reason why The Rock is known as the most electrifying man in sports entertainment, and that's his unmatched charisma. What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? The shoulders are down. Two. The Rock continues to punish his opponent. Oh, he looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a dangerous position to be in. He needs to be able to find a way to clear the cobwebs and regroup. Oh, the Rock's charisma is undeniable, Michael. I'll give you that. I wouldn't be surprised to see him in movies one day. This is what every competitor dreams of when they decide to get into this business, a match at the granddaddy of them all. WrestleMania. We're looking at complete domination here. This could end it in a hurry. This is such a painful hold. I have a strong feeling that these guys will throw caution to the wind and just go full steam ahead. I hope you're right. That's exactly what I want to see. John, as WWE's first ever third generation superstar, it could be said that The Rock was born to be in this business, that he was destined to become a WWE superstar. That's right, Michael. Both The Rock's daddy and his granddaddy were big stars before him. Of course, I'm referring to Rocky Johnson and high chief Peter Maivia. And into the cover. Two. Steve Austin making his statement as we speak. Quit running your mouth and let them do this thing. Reversal. The Rock showing his skills. Going for broke. That's it. He's done. There it is. The finisher. This could all be over right now. At the time of his WWE debut. Quick pin. Hey, is this it? Uh, it may be. Two. This match is being televised around the world in 18 languages and in over 110 countries. Absolutely amazing. The world is watching, and I guarantee you they're going to love it. Here we go. Uh-oh. Climbing the turnbuckle. Incoming! Look at these two. Here's the cover. Cole, you're right. The Rock's success wasn't immediate. Who can ever forget the chant of die, Rocky, die? But he overcame it all and became one of the most successful. Oh, that's going to put an end to this one. Is this it? Uh-oh. The people's elbow. That should do it. Well, the shoulders are down. We're looking at complete domination here. Look out. Look, Luthez press. Man, that did Luthez proud. That's it. The referee's not going to go in for the cut. One, two. And you know your finisher is a big deal when the WWE names an entire pay-per-view after it, which is what happened in December of 1998 when WWE presented Rock Bottom. And a solid punch from The Rock. Oh, 
the strength. Wait, is he still conscious? Man, that looked bad. Boy, there's no way he's going to be able to stand after that. Hey, Cole, this could do it. I think so. Two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. There was no love lost in that match. And look at the impact in these highlights. You want to talk about crowd pleasing? Look at this. This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. Oh, there were some unbelievable highlights. Watch this. Here's your winner, The Rock. Enormous victory right there. At the risk of getting ahead of myself, if this guy keeps winning matches like that, we better reserve some room for him in the Hall of Fame. And it looks to me like our winner is already thinking about the next match. Always one step ahead.